At this monastery outside Kathmandu, Dr. Sandukruit is arriving with the mission. He may not be a household name, but his work has touched millions. He hopes to restore the sight of all these people who suffer from cataracts. An estimated 150,000 people in Nepal are blind because of cataracts. 60-year-old Gani Mayalama has been blind in both eyes for over a year. I've cried for months. I have to depend on my grandchildren even to walk. I told them to push me off the cliff, but they refused to. Hundreds of people from neighboring districts started gathering here since last night. Over the next two days, Dr. Ruth with his team will operate on around 200 people who are partially or totally blind. Dr. Ruth removes the damaged cataract safely and replaces it with a synthetic lens. The entire procedure requires no stitches and takes just five minutes. When we started popularizing this technique around the world and uh, many of our own colleagues, particularly the ones from developed countries, thought that this is an inferior technique and uh, uh, gives us uh, suboptimal results. Dr. Ruth proved them wrong. Not only do patients recover near perfect vision the day after the operation, the sterile technique can be used with ease in remote areas, reaching out to people like 64-year-old Bhim Bahadur. He was born deaf and mute. For two years, he's also been blind. This technique has really gone beyond borders globally and uh, in many parts of Africa, South, Amer South America and uh, Asia and uh, even in developed countries, people do it. Dr. Ruth himself has performed over 100,000 operations. Doctors from as far afield as the USA and North Korea come to train under him. Only 20 to 25 dollars is enough to provide uh, for cataract surgery with a lens. Uh, and that's really been revolutionary in terms of being able to provide surgery to the masses. Lenses manufactured in Nepal are exported to over 70 countries. In mobile camps like this one, treatment is free. The morning after the surgery, it's time for the bandages to come off. It's like looking at God. I'm proud of my patients and, uh, you know, I'm, I'm in their hearts and they are in my hearts. Well, that's uh, what I really say. These tears of joy are priceless. With each five-minute surgery, Dr. Ruit gives his patients a vision of a better future. Sabina Shreshta, Al Zira, Pulari Monastery, Nepal.